This morning, we are taking you back to school <laughs> with a new segment. That's right. It's time for social studies. This is a new segment on Mornings at 10. And today, Professor Panetta yes. here to teach Look us out. valuable mm. lessons oh. on social media. Watch out. And of course, she brought session. props. And I did bring props. This is for you. Pass this down to Pedro. Okay. Okay. Yes. A pocket oh. protector. Studies was my favorite. Okay. You get a pointer. Wow. I get a pointer. And Danny, if you were a teacher, I'm sure you got would get plenty of apples. So I would. That's for you. This was sitting on the desk. So earlier, class is like in snack. session. Pay attention. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Oh wait, I got to take these off. These are really <laughs> bright. <laughs> Welcome to social studies. We're going to be helping you out and teaching you and our audience how to spot scams, save money, and use social media like your phone, your computer, on apps like Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Today in our inaugural class, we're going to learn about profile pictures, how they can be used to sometimes trick others. Now take a look at this, guys. We all have our profile pictures here too. These are our forward-facing Facebook and Instagram accounts from our friends here at Channel 7, including yeah. yours. Um, have you ever received a friend request from somebody you're already friends with and wondered, you know, why, oh, why is this person befriending you again? Mm -hmm. Or been contacted by someone like one of your friends saying, hey, do you have a new account? Because I just got a new friend request from you. It's your picture, but they're asking me, you know, the, for money. Have you ever had that happen? Yes, 100%. All, all the time. Uh, time. To really? So many people steal mm -hmm. our pictures and then message other people asking for money. It's, it's yeah. so scary. But your friends have warned you. Yeah, yeah. I've had a lot of DMs from other I'm people. I'm usually too. DMing. Our friends other and, like, hey, and our viewers are yeah, the ones that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, our viewers are really good that they get on that. So yeah. there's a decent chance it's a fake account. Someone trying to engage with you for a simple goal to scam you and your real friends. We reached out to Social Catfish. You guys know what this is? It's a, right. it's a site which helps people verify you know, if they are who they really are oh, cool. Cool. online. Yes. And let's hear from David McClellan. He's the founder who made scraping the internet for fake profiles a very successful business so here is his warning those are cases that especially if you're going to respond that it's really important to run an image search to know if the person's real or not they're either trying to get money from you they're trying to get access to your identity um, or they want to talk to you to see if you'll help mon uh, launder money literally those are the only three reasons that these people contact you Okay, so check this out. Social Catfish has a service which can also run your profile photo to see if someone stole your image account. So I, as the guinea pig, asked them to do a search. This is what they found using just one of my profile pictures. You have some really amazing things that popped up, some initiatives that you're part of, and so I'll go through those. Um, but then there's one thing that I'll reveal that I think you'll be a little shocked to see. Oh, no. It's not like scandalous, is it? Um, I think you'll laugh a little bit. Oh, I'm scared. We found some some straightforward things, right? Like your social media, which is really easy for anybody to find and, and access. Um, another thing we found is uh, an event that you went to and, and this news media outlet, you know, they just uh -huh. talk to you and, and how great you are. This one's going to be a little shocking. So this is a website and they have your feet on their website. Wait, is this like a foot fetish website that my feet are on? It is a foot fetish website, yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let me see your feet. <laughs> oh, no. 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 I'm trying to hide no. them. No. I'm so, hide they can, I'm so cringy. Stop looking. <laughs> They're cute. Stop looking. Every I get it, guys. Take it off. It's your lean. Focus, safe focus. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Okay, I have a question. <laughs> Let's change the subject. I have a question. How do you find out if an image is fake oh. or not your friend? Mm. Good, good question. question. Very good question. You have to do what's called a reverse image search. And first, I want to show you case in point. Meet Rob Bridges. He's a social media influencer, and people love to steal his picture and then put it everywhere mm. and use it for other purposes like scams on social media or dating sites. He gave us his permission to show him and how he's being used and abused. The first thing you need to do um, if you don't want to, this to happen is to save your profile picture if you want to check it out and then right click on it okay put it in your computer or your phone go to drag it into google images oh, wow. okay save the picture drag it into google images that in the search window if you click see exact matches you will find hundreds and hundreds of fake profile pages this is canada this is a french website it's images with his picture 
and being used all over the place for, for looking for love. And this guy's a married, you know, father, married wow. for 18 years. Wow. And it was all using that original picture of him and his dog. So, so if you, if someone, you know, mm -hmm. you don't, you don't, you really, you really don't want this to happen to you. Sure. Ooh. That's crazy. <laughs> Scary, yeah. too. And there's ways you can, you know, help yourself. Yeah, I yeah, want to so show you how. You, okay. Definitely. Yes, yes. You want to make sure that you report it on Facebook or Instagram. And then if it's on a website, uh, you can request a takedown. Um, oh. And that will sometimes uh, cause you to, you can pay for it. Or uh, there's a lot of these services like uh, Payfish and also Social Catfish mm -hmm. um, will ask you for a little bit of a fee. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But make sure you do that in writing so they get your profile off that page. Okay. Oh. Even your feet, guys. That, even um, your feet. You know what? That's very scary. And you with that pointer. Also scary. Scary. Well, let's make sure you behave because these, like these have a multi purpose. Yes, they do. I'm from the era where these could be used for paddling. Oh. Right? Well. You were bad. We don't do that anymore. I'm not. We don't. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm scared okay, of that. that that's so, such great information, though, <laughs> because people make fake accounts with our sure. pictures all the, all the time. We will never ask you for money ever. So. And we'll put it on our website, those yeah. steps on how to Thank do that. Thank you so yeah. much Thank for that, so Nina.